Hey guys, today we are going to be taking a look at Barbara. She is a four star hydro catalyst user. Um, <sighs> all the standing around is making me so sleepy. Okay, well, I mean, let's just let's hop in, I suppose. Starting with the profile, of course, Church of Favonius. You guys go for the bio. Um, you can pause the video if you'd like. Over to the talents, we have her normal attacks. Perform up to four splash attacks that deal hydro damage. Um, her charge attack consumes a certain amount of stamina to deal AoE hydro damage after a short casting time. And then her plunging attack, gather the might of uh, hydro. Barbara plunges towards the ground from midair, damaging all enemies in her path. Healing AoE Hydro damage, the, the usual, the usual. Here are the skill attributes at level 1. We have Let the Show Begin. Summons water droplets resembling musical notes that form a melody loop, dealing Hydro damage to surrounding enemies and afflicting them with the wet status. Melody loop reads, Barbara's normal attacks heal all party members and nearby allied characters. For a certain amount of HP, which scales off of Barbara's max HP. Her charge attack regenerates four times the amount of healing, regenerates a certain amount of current character's HP at regular intervals, and it'll also apply the wet status to the character and enemies who come in contact with them. So here is the uh, skill attributes for that. Technically, Barbara is like your designated healer in the game. All her abilities are basically all healing, you know, her and her, her ultimate. Um, her normal attacks right here, as long as you have Melody Loop active, will just continuously heal yourself and all allied members, which also work in co-op as well, off of your max HP. So you basically just want to keep building max HP on Barbara for more healing and not so much more like attack like uh, Jean or Chi Chi, for example. And then we have Shining Miracle, her ultimate. Heals friendly forces in all parties for a large amount of HP that scales with Barbara's max HP. So it's just, you pop your ultimate, it's an instant heal. That simple. Here's the uh, skill attributes. We have Glorious Season, her first passive. The stamina consumption of characters within Let the Show Begin, which is her E, um, is reduced, or Melody's loop is reduced by 12%. Stamina consumption of characters. Interesting. So I'm assuming that goes just for you. Because you can't actually have other people in co-op be within the uh, Let the Show Begin, the Melody Loop. It's just for you. So I guess their stamina consumption is reduced by 12%. That's interesting. So stamina heavy characters would benefit off of that. Uh, we have Encore. When a character gains an elemental orb or a par particle, duration of Let the Show Begin for E... Um, is extended by one second, and the maximum extension is five seconds. Interesting. Depending on how often it'll go off, um, I think that's another, like, I think that's like an extra heal or something, one extra healing proc. Um, and then the last one, when a perfect cooking is achieved on a dish with restorative effects, there is a 12% chance to, to obtain double the product. Simple. For constellations, gleeful songs, Barbara regenerates regenerates one energy every ten seconds. That's a small amount. I don't know. You, <laughs> that seems like a small amount. You need like eighty energy to get her alts. I don't know about that one. Constellation two, decrease the cooldown of let the show begin by fifteen percent. That seems good. During the ability's duration, the character uh, the current character gains fifteen percent hydro damage bonus. Okay. I mean, it's not going to be that great on Barbara because you need to build pure attack or pure HP, right? Not more so attack uh, or elemental mastery. We have increases the level of uh, Shiny Miracle, her ultimate, by three. Constellation four. Every enemy Barbara hits with her charge attack, it regenerates one energy for her. Ooh. A maximum of five energy can be regenerated in this manner with any one charged attack. That seems a lot better than what we saw at Constellation 1. Okay. Increases let the show begin begin by 3, which is her E ability. And then Constellation 6, when Barbara is not on the field and one of her party members falls, automatically revives this character? 
only regenerates this character's HP to 100%? What? It can only occur once every 15 minutes. When Barbara is not on the field. When someone else is in. Okay, so you have her in the party. You have someone else, your main DPS, of course, doing damage. If they die, it'll automatically revive them. Up to full HP, a second chance. That is crazy, dude. I know Barbara is like the designated healer. You're not going to use her as DPS. You're going to use her just for synergy and healing, and that's it, you know? Because you want to keep building attack or HP. She's not like Jean or Chi Chi where you can um, increase your attack, which will increase your healing. But that's kind of crazy, Constellation 6. And Barbara is a, um, a four star. That's not bad, especially in the Spiral Abyss, too. Interesting. Um, okay, these are the artifacts we're going to be working with. They're all level zero. I'm on another, uh, I'm on my first account. And we're using this weapon. And here are the skill attributes. Well, we're level one. But I'm hoping we can do this uh, character review justice, you know? Super hard. We should be too. So here is her walking. Oh, here is her jog. Here's her run. And into the auto attacks. Like so. I think it's four, right? One, two, three, and four. For charge attack. Little rainbow. Okay. And her E ability. So we'll have these uh, musical notes going around our body, which will heal us every uh, so often. And as well as... Wait, we don't have the wet effect on us. What, what gives? Oh, there it goes. It's like bugged. It's applying it and getting rid of it. As you can see in the bottom left. It's supposed to keep the wet effect on us forever, I think. Or maybe that's not a bug. In closed beta test 3, it kept it on your person forever, but now it's not. And I never liked Barbara because it kept your character wet the entire time. So trying to fight electric characters, for example, and you get electrocuted, you'd shock yourself, you know? Same thing with, like, ice users. If you were going up against ice users and you used Barbara's healing and it applied wet to yourself constantly 24-7, you'd freeze yourself over and over and over. But if this is not a bug and this is intended, that makes Barbara a little bit better, you know? Not gonna lie, it does. Um, and then we'll showcase her ultimate right here for you all. Ready, steady, go. I think Barbara is the only character in the game, the only four-star character in the game, that has an animation for her ultimate. I could be wrong. There could be someone else. Let me know if I'm mistaken. But normally, when characters have an animation like that for their alt, um, a little cinematic, it means they're a five-star character. You know? And I think the only thing that can come off... The only... Character that I can think of right now is Barbara. That's a four star that has a um, a cinematic like that. But anyways, without further ado, I just wanted to show off the plunge for you guys as well. Let's get into the combat, yeah? Okay, so here will be our test subject. Hopefully he doesn't kill us with this. Wanted to take a bit of damage. So normally Barbara isn't going to be your main damage dealer like we went over for her uh, her talents and her t um, constellations. She's normally just going to be here for healing, support, and you synergize her with someone else. In this case, it would be Lisa, but I want to show off uh, Barbara's healing. So we're down a lot of health right now. We have 849 left. I don't want to take another hit of that because I don't know if I'll live. But if we end up hitting our E ability... You can see that we healed 480, which will heal us again after so many seconds right there. And if we left click, you'll see that we're healing 90 quite consistently. I'll most likely need to um, get hit some more to show that off. And of course, we're applying wet to enemies near us in our vicinity when we are using our E ability. We'll get smacked around a little bit, not die, but the perfect use so let's show this. Let's show this. We hit our E ability. You can left click with Barbara. And you can see 
90, 90, 90, 90, 90. Like every time we're auto attacking, we're right back, we're right back up to full HP. And that auto attack will heal the entire party as well as any other ally in co-op. So um, her healing is based off of her max HP. Like I said, it's not like Jean or Chi Chi where it goes off for her attack. So you're mainly not going to be using Barbara as a DPS source. Trust me, I tried. I tried to go half damage, half healing, and I, it just wasn't working. I wanted the best of both worlds, and it wasn't there. So normally what I'll do is I'll synergize with Lisa. This is like my bread and butter. We use Amber to make the enemy wet. Switch over to Lisa. Zap, zap, zap. A little bit of electro charge, and then switch back to Barbara. Add more wet back to them, and just keep switching back and forth. Simple as that. This is normally what I do <laughs> with Lisa. And then whenever um, we need Lisa uh, to be healed, we just use the E ability on Barbara and continue on like so. And this team that I have right here with Barbara and Lisa, at least in like closed beta test 2 and 3, it was able to carry me quite far in the spiral abyss normally what i would do is i would just put barbara and lisa on a team by themselves because they could handle a team by themselves you know the synergy between them because they're both catalyst users and one's electric and one's hydro and barbara can also heal lisa uh when it comes down to it it's perfect synergy right And there you go. As easy as that. Not a scratch on us. But I would uh, in no way use Barbara as a damage source. Not a main DPS. I would let Lisa take over to synergize. Barbara is pretty straightforward. She's Her abilities are just healing. Healing and hydro application. And then her ultimate is just one big heal, like we showed off. It's just one big heal that just heals your your health, and that's it. That's 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 pretty much it, guys. That's pretty much it. I don't think I need to get too much into this, right? I think we covered everything. I think this is good. If this wasn't good. Let me know. Let me know. Um, if I missed anything, if you guys still have any questions about Barbara, please let me know down in the comments section below. Let me know what you guys think about Barbara. Oh god. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it was informative. And I hope to see you guys next time.